Good morning. It's Hope from Cedar Hollow Gardens. And as you can see, I'm in my front where my box used to be. I have changed things up a little bit. Welcome to my channel if you're new, first of all. But I want to show you something. I'm updating you on what I did a month ago. Remember November 3rd, I had sprouts? Well, let's walk around this corner again, guys, and take a look at me now. Do you see how many more there are? Like I said, on this side is the spinach. <laughs> it's like musical rocks. <laughs> but I just wanted you to see the mosh or corn salad is starting to sprout. So next year, I know to get a much bigger head start. I didn't plant these soon enough. I planted these probably the last couple weeks of October, probably the 16th. And I think I'll have to do this next time in September. But as you can see, I'm going to get a good bit of spinach, so I'm excited. <laughs> Just stop uncovering. Oh, he wants to show you a close shot. Sorry. And we're going to walk back in the back, and we'll show you what's going on under those um, bins. We did have any sprouts back here. So far, I haven't seen any. But we'll take a walk and take a look anyways. And maybe... Just maybe we'll get a chance to go under our makeshift cold frame that's on the big bed. But all those marigolds are going to get picked and um, harvested for seed exchange purposes. You see I have ice on the tops of this. And I got sprouts here too. Not near as many. And these are a little dry. So can I have that ice actually in the bed? That would actually help me. Thank you. And I'll see if I can't break it off better. But we'll get these watered. And let's take a peek at these. See if there's any sprouts over here. Wrong way. Oh, sorry. This one doesn't look to be doing anything. Oh, did you see something there? Yep. Oh, he's got a sprout. A sprout. But those I haven't transplanted yet. It's been very cold here. It's 38 degrees today here on... Except, uh, no, ugh, December 7th in Chicago, Zone 5B, under one layer of cover. Even though there's very little growing, there is growth. So, if you're thinking you need to stop gardening for the winter, I encourage you, please, think again. That's all I got because I'm freezing. <laughs> so, I'm going to say... Um, I'm going to pack it up for now and, um, oh no, we're going to walk in the house and we'll show you the um, update on the... We'll show you one more picture. Pellets. 